Hello, my name is Andre Fernandez. I'm a scientist at Zimmer and Peacock. I'm here today to show you, demonstrate our uh, developed by Zimmer and Peacock, our uh, breath collection system. It's a handheld device uh, where you have a mouthpiece. After a mouthpiece, you have a valve system where, in order for you to breathe in and out through the same mouthpiece, uh, you have uh, humidity and uh, CO2 detector sensors on this part and this is the interface and in this slot here is where the sensor cartridge goes so we develop sensor cartridges these are the sensor cartridges so you see an electrochemical sensor there to uh, so that will detect a specific molecule that we are interested in the human breath and uh, and the, the 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 breath will be collected in this area here and which will go uh, down to the active area of the sensor so we collect about four microliters with this cartridge and uh, this is important to to, to, to to say that it actually can be used you can pipette from these collection cartridges you can pipette and into other devices and actually run other devices the sample on other devices so here I'm going I'm going to insert the um, the cartridge in its position and I'm going to put back the mouthpiece together with the valve system I'm going to turn on the system and uh, here I'm going to start testing so you can have two versions with or without uh, touchscreen and uh, I'm not so worried. So we have we have to control the temperature. So in order to to collect the liquid from the breath, here is where you put the patient's ID. I'll just leave it as it is now. Uh, we have inserted the sensor cartridge, and so it's starting cooling process where we have to wait for it to reach the desired temperature. In this case, it's three degrees Celsius. So this is. A little bit of waiting here and at the time being I'm going to present uh, another person a scientist here as well at Zimmer and Peacock uh, and she will be the one actually blowing into the device and collecting the sample so we are now at 10 degrees about 10 degrees and once it's ready I'll give her the device for her to, to breathe in. About seven degrees. So the cooling is finished and it's it says that the is asking if the patient is ready for exhale. And so I'm gonna press OK. But first, so once I press OK the person will start breathing in. Okay. So she will breathe in for about 10 seconds and the sample will be collected into the sampling cartridge where the sensor is. So in this case it's set to breathe for about one minute. It's five seconds remaining now. And that's okay. So now a different light comes in and the patient can stop to, to exhale and is making the assay. So so and it tells the remaining time. Once the assay is finished, we can then pipette the, the sampling fluid from her breath into, into a different uh, beaker or device for 
a different analysis or an analysis with a different equipment. So 10 seconds remaining. And there you go. In this case, it has finished. So it has finished running the assay. It's complete. And uh, I'm not going to restart it. In this case, I'm going to turn on the device, uh, turn off the device, sorry. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the, um, the cartridge, the sensor cartridge. And you can see that you have collected, you have liquid there so it's the condensed condensed exhaled breath from me and i'm going to pipette this so with a with a pipette tip i'm going to try to show i'm going to pipette i'm pipetting about four to five microliters and i'm just going to dispense on this speaker here to see that we have enough sample to use on a different detector. And depending on the person that actually is breathing in, you could have more sample available for, for, uh, for using as well. So I hope this was a good video for you to understand our device and uh, good luck in the future. Thank you.